A unique effort to bring medical advice to underserved communities while promoting a healthy lifestyle was the inspiration for Memorial Hermann's Walk with a Doc today. Fox 26's Shelby Rose reports from Acres Homes. Today we're going to talk about arthritis. This is Dr. Benedict Ifedi, the face of Memorial Hermann's Walk with a Doc in Acres Homes. We walk around the neighborhood for about five to ten minutes with the goal of encouraging the people in the community to get active, get exercise, mobilize their joints. Then he'll host a discussion on a health topic, educating this group, taking questions and giving medical advice. Today's topic arthritis. Today's discussion is some of the things people didn't know, like how gout is a form of arthritis and the different forms of arthritis and arteriosclerosis and different things like that. Again, it's informative and not only do we get the information, but we carry it on to our family and to our friends as well. Walk with a dog happens once a month and has been serving the Acres Home residents for about a year. Dr. Ifedi taking his time off to give back to the community. To being able to do that with Walk with a Doc, to lead by example, literally walk the walk, talk the talk, um, is something that was you know very near and dear to my heart, and you know it gives me so much joy just to be able to you know come out here, have people show up, participate, you know want to listen to what I have to say. And his efforts are more than appreciated by those who show up. I think it's great that he takes time out and he thinks enough of us, and it's very informative and it's been very helpful. It's really, really helpful that he's given his time for us because that shows that he cares and he does more than just you know nine to five Monday through Friday on the weekends he actually gives his time to give back. But it doesn't stop at walking. Memorial Herman also hosts Dance with the Doc where participants can also have a little fun with Zumba. Reporting in Acres Homes, Shelby Rose, Fox 26 News.